Om Shanti, welcome to 14th of October's Gauri Blessings. Rupi Mahathir says, May you stop listening to wasteful news and increasing your interest in it and put a full stop and thereby become free from following the dictates of others. So other people can influence us by telling us something negative or something very exciting or interesting about somebody else's life, right? But God says don't do that. While moving along on this path, spiritual path, some children mix Shrimat with the dictates of other souls. So that when a Brahmin is relating news of the world, they listen to it with a lot of interest. Oh, that soul did this in the Yagya. Oh, that soul did that action even after so many years. And we are like, oh, okay. So a negative attitude, negative idea, negative response, negative, uh, let's say a reference point is created. That if it happens in my life, I'll be like, okay, it happened in their life. A senior person could do this. So if it happens in my life, it's okay. That's a very negative anchor or a reference point. You are unable to do anything about that and yet you listen to it. So that news goes into your intellect and time is then wasted. In what? Overcoming that negative thought. You keep on thinking about it. The more you think about it, it becomes a feeling. The more it becomes a feeling, it stays within you. And at some point, it's going to be used. And it's going to be used against us for our own bad. And that's too, it's going to be used by us. Therefore, the father's instructions are hear, but do not hear. That means, how do you do that? You can't just close your ears, right? You heard it, but don't create any feeling about it. That's the secret. That's known as Sakshi Bhava. Even if someone comes and tells you something, just put a full stop. Whatever you heard about someone, do not have any feelings of dislike in your vision or in your thoughts for that person. Even if that person is doing something bad to you or your relative or your friend or colleague, do not have any dislike, God says you would then be said to be free from the dictates of others. That means nobody else is controlling you or your mind. You are in control of your own mind. Om Shanti.